I thought I'd do a quick video just before I sort of mainly get start, started into the construction of this model railway. Now, clearly the shed we're in did not have a model railway in mind. It's designed for cars. But a chance comment by, well, it was a throwaway comment by the guy that was building the shed mentioned that I might be able to fit a track in behind the steel beam, steel girder, and the cladding rail there. And sure enough, I did a quick test and thought, yeah, that's great. It fits. The initial idea was being to run a track from that end all the way back up to this end, just a basic end-to-end -end test track, just so I can test out some of my locomotives. And then, well, the idea kind of took seed and rooted and germinated, and now I've gone into a bit more of a substantial layout, effectively what will be a loop at one end, a dog, a dog bone. So there's a loop at each end um, with, a, with a return track on each side. So this end is uh, what I've got done so far, and that will be to support um, the full loop. I've made it pretty sturdy because what I've realised is with the height, this is fairly high, a little bit higher than I would have liked. Clearly I was dictated to by the height of the existing cladding rail. And I've made it with fairly hefty timber, basically because what I've realised is to actually lay the track, I'm going to more or less have to get up the top there and, and kneel on it. So I've tested it, it does support my weight. I'm quite happy about that and you can see underneath it's all fairly heavy duty stuff, it's quite big um, timbers. And I was a little bit concerned about the fact that I wouldn't be able to reach, because I'm hoping for a roughly a 30 inch radius curve, and I thought I wouldn't be able to fit in round, round to this side, so I've just left a little gap at the back here where I can pop up and do that. And uh, yes, so I'm now constructing this on, and what I'm doing is, this is bottom shelf here, it's going to be the staging tracks, as you can see I've lined everything up so it just clears and then on top of the cladding rail is where the, is where the main top section of the board will go. So that's where we're at at the moment.